This is what is the square root of 1600. So the square root of 1600. Square root of 1600, again, we're gonna use this term of prime factorization. And what we're doing is we're taking out uh, numbers that we think that, uh, that are prime factors of 1600 here. So the best thing I would do is I would, all, if I'll, every time I see an even number, I would always take out two, right? So I'm gonna take out root two here, and then I'm gonna get 1600 divided by root two, or 1600 divided by two is simply just 800, right? So I have 800 here. 800 is another even number, so we can take out another root two. So two root twos now, and then 800 divided by two is root 400. This here is good. Uh, I can do the exact same thing and take out this number again. So root two times root two times root two times uh, 400 divided by two would be two root 200. And then we do the exact same thing one more time here. So root two times root two times root two. Take out another root two here. 200 divided by root two is root 100 here, right? And now at this point, what we can do is I can simply say that uh, root 100 here is equal to 10, right? So I have root two times root two times root two times root two times 10 here, right? Because root 100 I know is 10. So I have 10 here. Root two times root two is simply just two. And then root two times root two is simply just two, right? So I'm gonna have, so these, all four of these terms cancel out. So it's 10 times two times two here, which will equal 10 times four, which is 40. So which means the square root of 1600 is 40. So this here is the correct answer. This here equals 40. And as you can see, what they're doing here is they are, um, what they're doing is, oh, they just knew, they just, they just knew that it was the square root of 40. Or square, uh, they just knew that the answer was 40 without really doing any um, uh, any steps here. So I would say the solution here is correct. Solution is correct, but no steps were shown. No steps were shown to figure out the answer. So that's probably going to be it.